Okay, I'm gonna try to throw it from the top. This coin can't fit through the door. Okay. This is a uh, person's worst nightmare come true. We're Nicole Amigo. In 2021, we decided to take the leap and try our nine to five jobs in order to travel full time. We believe travel is one of the best ways to build understanding between people. So we've hit the road on a journey to learn more about new cultures, unique places, and different foods. We'd love for you to join us, and if you're interested in coming along, you'll find new videos here twice a week. <laughs> Welcome to today's video. We're in Georgia. Uh, we're in the capital, Tbilisi. And today we're just going to be walking around, hanging out, and exploring the city. Yep, it should be a big full day. We'll see how far our legs can take us. Um, yeah. We've made it to our first stop of the day. This is Gallery 27, which is known for its beautiful stained glass. People come here for photo ops. Today is to a place called Maiden Bazaar. Should have lots of cool things to look at, do a little bit of shopping. I think we'll buy anything, but. Nah, we just want to wander around, look at what types of things you can get here. We don't yeah. have any room in our backpacks to buy anything. <laughs> we'll check it out, anyways. <laughs> yeah, gotta take a, take a peek. So we just learned that the Maiden Bazaar was part of the Silk Road. It was a busy crossing here in Tbilisi. It has been one of the oldest business centers in Tbilisi since like 4th or 5th century BC. This place really smells like spices and wine. There's so many cool little trinkety things here like swords and like pipes and things like that. I feel like there's like a tribute to like the... Uh... Vikings. Yeah, that's exactly. <laughs> I don't know why. The funny part is like there's so many things on the wall and then you'll look up at the ceiling and there's tons of stuff on the ceiling too. I don't know if they're for sale or if they've just been here for centuries. <laughs> Next stop is the Peace Bridge. On the bridge of peace. It's not, not very peaceful. There's, lot, there's lots of people trying to sell you sell you boat tours. And also they've got like pet animals here. They would like you to take pictures with or... They want you to take pictures with their parrots and and peacocks and things That's like that. We love. So right at the end of Bridge of Peace is Wreck Park which is really beautiful. So nice. Surprisingly beautiful. Very green. I was expecting just more of like a grass area, but there's beautiful trees here too. I've, oh. I've got a new appreciation for life. <laughs> After being stuck in there for what seemed like hours. It was like three minutes. <laughs> it felt like hours. <laughs> three minutes. <laughs> I'm not sure if you can see me, but this is a uh, person's worst nightmare come true. I'm in a public washroom where you pay one lorry to get in. And now whenever I want to press the button to open the door, the door is not opening. <laughs> I feel like I'm kind of stuck in here. A little bit scary. Nothing, eh? Okay, let me um, try to... I got the... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna see if I can throw it to you through the cracks of the door. Like on the side here, I'm not sure. Hold on. I could try to... How about on the ground? No, like, is there a lip on the ground? Okay, I'm gonna try to throw it from the top. The lorry is too big. 
This coin can't fit through the door. Huh? Okay. You sure? Okay. Well, this is a bit of a predicament. Okay, don't leave me! So this will be forever known as the time I got stuck inside a public washroom. Never get out. I was, I, too. <laughs> I was so scared. Oh my god! Thank God for kind strangers. <laughs> Rescued. That's, that's what happens when you try to cheat the public washroom so out of one lorry or one. That's so true. Dollar, what is that? Not uh, even a dollar. Even Sixty cents. Don't do it, people. Don't do it. It traps you inside. <laughs> Love it. Well, how that happened is it takes one coin to go inside the washroom. So Nicole got into the washroom. And then when she came out, she asked me if I wanted to use it while holding open the door. So I'm like, okay, great. You so know, I just held the door open. Just, just held the door in. open. And I walked in without having to pay for myself. <laughs> and then when I try to get out, apparently out. it like registers that the door opened and then the door closed, which means that nobody should be in there. So you have to put in another coin in order to get in. Well, it's very difficult to put in another coin when I have the wallet and I'm <laughs> inside, trapped inside the public washroom and Nicole's outside. <laughs> <laughs> um, our bad, we will not do that again. And I think maybe I'll even put one laddie in my backpack in case this ever happens in the future so that I can save us. But hey, look where we've come. Look yeah, we've enjoyed place. this part. Look at this gorgeous spot. Beautiful fountain in the background, gorgeous trees. the things we've noticed in the city so far is all the cool street artwork and street graffiti that we were seeing. It's uh, in a lot of different places, mostly on these underground passageways, and they're beautiful. Lots of creativity. made it to the Holy Trinity Cathedral and wow, it is huge. So big. Actually, it's the third largest cathedral, I think they said in the world, in terms of area. It was only built in 2004, finished in 2004, it took almost 10 years to build. Wow. Man, it is something. Holy smokes. inside the Holy Trinity Church Cathedral. Uh, we can't film in there, no cameras allowed. In order to, for us to get in, we had to kind of cover our legs and Well, and the head. he could to cover his legs, yeah, yeah, from his shorts, and then I had to wear something over top of my head, so um, that's that was kind of funny. Adorable. It was a good get up, but they gave it to us, which is so nice. Like they just had it on hand and they just yeah. gave us a few things, yeah. otherwise we wouldn't have been able to get in. Yeah. So that was, uh, that was lucky. When you look from the outside, you can see how tall the church is, but yeah. when you go inside, you can see that it actually is that tall. It's like, like it, super it domed. Goes, yeah, it goes yeah. all the way up to the top. It's really beautiful. Um, with no obstructions. It was gorgeous. So we've made it to our next location. This is the Dry Bridge Flea Market. And it's just an arrangement of uh, shops along the bridge. And everybody just kind of has different stuff out and we'll see what they're selling. That was pretty cool. Well, that was really cool. It was just like being in like, your grandma's attic. Yeah. Well. But if your grandma was like from Soviet Russia. Yeah, so not your grandma. But. <laughs> yeah. Because there was, like it went from like being kind of like a garage sale, kind of like a yard sale vibe to like mm -hmm. cleaning out some really old houses yeah. from like 
yeah, it like Soviet era. Mix. Yeah, because there was so. some really cool, like old film cameras, mm -hmm. and then you get like gas masks. <laughs> it was it was strange. You know, next time I need a Soviet era medal, <laughs> I know where to get one. <laughs> Honestly, if walking around Tbilisi didn't convince you it was gorgeous, just wait until sunset. This place lights up so well. Okay, so there's no tramway. So we have to do the old-fashioned way. <laughs> tramway would probably have been easier. That's alright. But we're getting up pretty high now. Yeah. And the views behind us are pretty awesome. Yeah. And it's only getting better. If only... We make it to the top though, so we'll see. We're at the final steps of Narakawa Fortress. Almost to the top now. There's a little bit more to go. So we finally made it to the top, last part of the day. Nothing left to do but just sit here and watch the sunset. Mm, which is great, because we've had a busy day. Yeah. We're beat. Yeah. It's a great day. Awesome day. Tbilisi, you are awesome. <laughs> we had yeah. fun. Now we're just gonna watch this gorgeous sunset. Until next time, thanks for watching. Come on then before. How do you do it? I don't know. It's not a button. I don't want to touch it! We would like to cross. <laughs> Who's your pal? This is uh squares. This is kind of a two square, so. I mean, it's kind of like spots, but it's covered in little squares. That's what I think of her joke, too. <laughs> oh my god. You want me to go up that? Okay. How do I do that? Let go. Thanks for watching. Yeah. <laughs> 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 ah.